Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to day 9 of 13 days of liquid lipstick and today we have is the Beauty Creations Longwear Matte Lip Gloss. Now these are not glossy by any means and it is a pure matte formula. So I have heard about Beauty Creations before they were launched in India which if I'm not wrong it was by end of 2019 and I have heard about them because they are known for duping a lot of high-end brands. So when I saw that they were launched I was like why not and i picked out six shades so as always check out the description box below to see the shade names and the foundation shade reference i am nc40 in mac now if you have not already then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to notify whenever i upload and now let's jump right in the video Now these liquid lipsticks are sold exclusively on hokmakeup.com and they are priced at 499 rupees for 4 ml of product and they come in 32 shades and lastly they are cruelty free as well. This is how the liquid lipstick looks like which comes in a transparent plastic tube with a black cap and it has all the information printed at the back. And this is how the doe foot applicator looks like. And now let's move on to the lip swatches. Now let's talk about the formula of these liquid lipsticks. Now first off, these are very pigmented as you guys saw during the swatches. Secondly, it does take some time to settle down which I'll come back to in a minute. But once it has settled down, it is comfortable and light on the lips. Now these are quite long lasting provided you do not have any oily food. Now I'll quickly insert a video of how it looks once I had a very heavy oily meal and you can see this very harsh line like just the outer line alone is visible but the rest of the lipstick is completely gone off and these are transfer proof as well for example like there is a hardly any transfer now I almost forgot to mention that these can be removed by using a micellar water you do not have to use an oil based cleanser or you know an oil infused micellar water anything of that sort just a good old micellar water will do the magic 
and that is that with the pro now coming to the cons the formula is very inconsistent for example the lighter shades like out of the six that i have there were two lighter shades and both of them went on very streaky on the lips i had to finesse it a lot for it to look a little bit presentable the next con is that once you apply it it takes like a solid minute or two for it to completely dry down and not be sticky because in that time gap of one or two minutes while it is settling down at that time if you press your lips together the lip color will actually move and get removed and there will be like a patchy spot on your lips which nobody likes and these have a very strong chemically kind of a smell and it kind of lingers for quite some time even after applying it and drying down so just fyi for those who are kind of sensitive to fragrances and the formula kind of reminds me a lot of the four color uh, liquid lipsticks which i have done a swatch like ages back but it kind of does smell and the formulas will remind me a lot of those liquid lipsticks now since the formulas were kind of inconsistent i'll quickly run through out of the six that i picked up which one were good and which one were bad now the first shade that i swatched which is number 19 dare me that was very streaky and then the second one which is a beautiful red it is 31 forever mine that was comfortable i waited for it to settle down and it was completely fine uh, the third shade which is number 33 lovely that is by far the best out of the six color wise the formula wise everything was fine the fourth shade number 40 naked which again was very streaky i do not like it number 43 pleasure that also went on really well and once i waited for it to settle down it was comfortable on the lips and last but not the least is the shade 48 malevolent that was not a good shade at all because it was sticky even after like 15 20 minutes after applying it so yeah overall for my opinion the cons kind of outweigh the pros and i do not recommend this collection at all but then if you're still planning to buy it then i would highly suggest you buy it during a sale like for example right now at the moment on hkmakeup.com these are being sold at 50 percent off so the price is slashed all the way down to 250 rupees but then these are not worth the full price of 500 rupees at all so yeah these were my two cents about the beauty creations long wear matte lip gloss and guys this wraps up today's video and i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it's 25 whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i will try my best to do that for you as well as follow me on my socials which is istishnayar on instagram and istishnayar on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye